78. Klar for Usain Bolt i bane 5. Ja, en superstart på Mike Rogers. Så kommer Usain Bolt. Og Kim Collins holder følge, men Bolt er klart den beste. Og er i mål på 9.85. Ja, fantastisk igjen av Usain Bolt. Det er ny årsbeste av Bolt. Det er altså årsbeste i verden. Speed. 25. Second clap. All right. And that camera's good, right? Camera over here is good? Cool. So, what I want to know is, at what age did you start dreaming about being an Olympic champion? After the World Juniors, really. Uh, I was 15. I ran in front of my home crowd, and the energy and the love that I got let me want to do more for my country, let me want to do more in track and field. And I was like, yeah, you know what? I want to be Olympic champion. At this stage of your career, how great is the pressure? For me, I try not to pressure myself too much uh, because the uh, worst thing you can do is start worrying. You got to remind yourself that, listen, I want to do good for myself. I have to just work hard and do my best. Uh, you got to remind yourself that uh, you can't win everything. You're going to win some, you're going to lose some, for sure. That's how the sport is. And the first thing my coach taught me when I was in the sport is that you got to learn how to lose before you can learn how to win. What was the focus coming into today's training session? Well, uh, it was all about speed and endurance today, uh, to get me around, to get me off that corner strong. So when, I, when I'm in the home stretch, I'm strong enough to get home. So I do a lot of work, speed and endurance to keep, to, to get it right. So, because the hardest part of a tournament is when you get into that home stretch and your body starts getting tired, your legs start dropping, and then you start slowing down. So the more work you do, the better you feel when you come in the straight so you can run home and stay upright and stay strong. Earlier in the, in the track season, you had the, the hamstring injury. Where are you strength-wise and health-wise? Well, um, I'm, I'm getting there. Uh, I'm definitely getting there. I'm feeling much better. Uh, I don't have any problems with my hamstring now, so that's good. Uh, I'm fully confident now in pushing myself in training. How much more do you need to be at your absolute best? For me, you, you don't know when you're going to get there. Uh, I think it, the key thing is uh, to train hard, and you definitely need competition. You definitely need uh, races in, because uh, I've learned over the years that training helps you, but you have to compete against other people who have a higher level to help to build you up, to make you know what, you, what else you need to work on in training. Everybody on this circuit has talent. So get over it. <laughs> don't feel that you're going to come on this circuit and because you're real talented that you don't have to train. Now it's all about who works their talent and brings out the best who's going to be a champion. You really have to push yourself now to step up a level. And every year you got to keep trying to step the level up. So it's talent on one hand, but you got to work to get it there. Great athletes in other sports, basketball, football, so on, they talk about the game slowing down. You're running 100 meters in nine seconds. Does it, does it feel like it's slowing down or does it go as quickly as it really is says on the clock? Some races are longer than some in your mind. I think uh, especially a championship race, uh, I can tell you from start to finish of every championship race I've ever been in. I take a mental note of everything. But in a normal race, it just goes by really quick. As a world record holder, how much faster can you get? You can never tell how fast you can go. But uh, for me, I think there's definitely room for improvement, especially over 200 meters. One of my biggest dreams is to, to really push the barrier and to get on the 19, sub-19. 100 meters now, uh, I've always said that 9.4 would be the limit. And I want to be that person. I want people to sit back and say, yo, you see him both when he was, back in his days, he was really the best. He made this game untouchable. Anything is possible. That's how I live my life. You can't limit yourself to anything. Really.